you ordered Ethernet service, and your telecom service provider sent you a site readiness document. Now you're wondering, what's Ethernet site readiness? Your Ethernet site readiness letter is the list of tasks you'll need to complete before the service provider will install your Ethernet. Think of it as a series of flaming hoops you've got to jump through before you get your Ethernet service working. Hoop 1. A validated conduit pathway into your building. Hoop 2. A pathway to your suite from the phone room. Hoop 3. Backboard space for circuit delivery. Hoop 4. A dedicated power outlet. And Hoop 5. Grounding for telecom service providers' equipment. Without experience and a firm understanding of the details, it's easy to get burned. The pain comes in the form of costly site revisits, delays, and mishaps. This video covers the essential tasks your local access provider requires you to complete prior to delivering your Ethernet service. Before jumping through any hoops, it's essential to understand and plan the details of your Ethernet project. Recommended steps are Site validate the readiness letter to determine the requirements provided are correct and accurate. Analyze requirements for cost savings and suggestions for changes in the specification. Meet with a building representative for approval. Set up a meeting with the local access provider engineer with readiness letter to nail down the exact requirements. Click the image to watch the next video in this series, sponsored by Concert Technologies. Or click the link below to visit our site and learn more.